Hi guys, welcome to Enigma Reviews and happy Halloween. So today I'm going to be doing a mixed haul of things that I have grabbed from various different places. I just thought I don't want to do a video of this on their own, I will do it as a collective piece. So I'm going to get straight into it guys because there's a lot to show. First thing I'm going to show is this lovely patch. So I ordered two patches, well my husband ordered me two patches from eBay. I have a reason for this guys and I'll probably show you in a picture through this video. I've bought this cat pumpkin iron on or you can stitch on transfer. I have got a bright orange jumper that just reminds me of a big orange pumpkin and I didn't want to stick any orange patches on there because it would just blend in. So I looked for a black one and I found this one. It'll just, my jumper is like a v-neck and orange. I'm probably just going to stick it here. I'll put video or a picture up of that when I've done it. But this was really inexpensive guys. I think it was a £3.95 and this was on eBay guys. So I just did a a random eBay for, for um, patches and then I grabbed another one there is a few more that I want to grab which I'll probably feature in a different video whenever I decide to grab them this one again was from the same buyer I think or it might have been a different one it, yeah it was a different one now this one is the Jack and Sally I absolutely love this there's a few that I want to grab I've recently bought a stripy dress and I absolutely love it, but it's very plain. I just thought by sticking this on the front of the dress, just to give it a bit of character and at the back, maybe having a big Jack Skeleton on the back, just makes it extra bit spooky, especially if you put a nice black gothic belt with it. Again, I think this was 3 99 maybe four pound at the most. So that was them two patches that I grabbed. Moving on, I seen this. And I couldn't help it. So guys, this is a Star Wars Series 1, The Child table lamp. And I just thought this is going to look cute in here. i got to have it. So I am mad when it comes to Yoda, the child, I should say. I love the child. I've got the child teddy bear. Zach's got all the, the child teddy bears for his birthday, which is coming up. And I can't wait to see his face when he gets the Hasbro one. But I've already took it out of the box to have a look at it. So the packaging is actually out of there. And this is what it looks like. It's very, very tiny, which I do know. But when you light it up, it's very, very bright. In fact, it looks so bright that it just looks really, really nice. It's really well made, guys. It's like a hard plastic. It reminds me of a pop, very much like a pop, big head, little body. Um, I would have liked, I might keep the box for this anyway. If the battery's going, I don't want to just like keep changing the batteries. I may put it back in the box and display it with my other pops because I do have two Yodas already. I want another two Yoda ones. And then it can go with the collection. But guys, this cost me £9 and I got this from JD Williams and I thought, I think I got money off. It was £10.20 and I think I got it from £8.20 or something or £9. But there you go, guys. That's my baby Yoda. So that was my second item. My third item is quite a heavy piece. So I spotted this um, Ouija board cat. I've been looking at this for the longest time. I'm not a cat person, guys. I don't mind cats, but I don't own any cats. I used to own a lot of cats when I was younger, but in my adult life, I've never had a cat. And I just seen this and I thought the purple ears, all the design of a Ouija board on here, all the way down, and it goes all the way around on the body. I like the whole design of this, like the filigree design. Absolutely love this, guys. I think I paid £16 for this. Um, you can get this from the Gothic... Oh, I forgot what it's called. It's gone through my mind. I will put it in the description box below. I think I paid £18, guys. And it's a Nemesis piece. As you know, I collect Nemesis. So I was quite happy at this for the price. Again, I got up some money off because I used the honey code. I think I may have got... Oh, I think it was my first time ordering from the, the place I got it from. I don't know. I got money off it. I always get money off somewhere. It might have been about two or three quid. But I thought for that, I'm really, really chuffed. So that was what I grabbed, guys. And then I grabbed this beautiful item. I will take it out of the box, guys. But I'll let you have a look at it in the pack. So its tail is rattling around. It's actually got a tail that attaches to the back. And the tail goes with the clock. And as you can see, it's a pussy cat clock. This is not for me. I only collect um, Nemesis clocks. This is a gift and I just I just know that she's gonna absolutely love it. As Soon as I seen it, I thought, well, that can be her Christmas present. I will get it sent with the rest of her stuff. And there's an invoice in there, if I take that out, or she'll know how much I paid. I don't want that, do we? So that was my 
fourth, fifth, fifth, fifth item. We'll go back in there. And then I grabbed this item because I could not resist. I'm going to just take it out of the packaging because my dress is on the front. And yay! I grabbed 2021's calendar in the hope that next year it's going to be better than this year because this year sucks. So yeah, I got the Tim Burton's from Disney, The Nightmare Before Christmas, Love is Eternal calendar. As you can see, this is the images at the back. It's a really, really nice calendar. I'm going to be putting this up on my wall. Um, I, let me just take it out quickly so you can see. I am obsessed with Jack Skeleton. Um, I am getting the Jack Skeleton Teddy for Christmas and I'm going to try and look for a blanket, a bedding and um, the cushions to go with it and Sally as well at some point but I'm not like obsessed with Sally, I'm obsessed with Jack but I do love Sally as well. Right, so taking out this cover, this was 9 99 guys, I paid £8 because I always get a reduction off because I always use my honey code, this is why I tell you people use your honey code, it gives you money off. So love is eternal. Let's quickly go through it. So here you've got Jack and Sally, most famous Jack Skeleton image. And it has all the months of the year there at the beginning. So I could hang this up now and then just let it wait. So Sally, a glow with moonlight is January. I missed one, my bad. My month, February, yay! Which is Jack, which is my birthday. Grin and bones, I love it. And I think zero was March. Yep, zero is March, absolutely love that. My mum's birthday in March and my daughter's birthday. Let me just take that cardboard out, it's preventing me. And then in April, we've got Jack again, Forever the Gentleman. Oh, we all love Jack. And then in June, we've got Ooga Boogie. And then, oh, there's so many. They're all stuck together, guys, to be honest with you. And then we've got the whole family of weirdos here, which I absolutely love. I'd like to get these in pots at some point. In July, <laughs> fantastic. And then August is Jack and Sally, him pronouncing his love to her. No words on that one. That's August. September, follow the moonlight, which is Sally and the cat. Lovely, lovely. I like the illustrations for this. I wonder if Hannah Horror could do me a Jack Skeleton. And then it's Sally again, dark romantic type, November. And then December, Jack, Misfits and Love, King of Fright. Guys, I've got to be keeping this even when I've used it all up. I just think it's amazing. I'll probably put some of these in frames as an idea, if you can find a frame big enough. So that was that, guys. And then my last item was from a company, guys, which I used to dabble in quite a lot when it comes to my boxes. I got my, I think it's my trick or treat boxes from Little Booty. Um, I had a look on there because she had two prints, two prints, extremely two reasonable price prints. So I got two boxes of the Protector and Stokes incense sticks because I love them. They smell lovely. I can't remember what scent for this was because I did read it at first and I thought I do like that. These were mega cheap as well, guys. Like, I think they were 40p or something or 69p. Now, what is the scent for this? It's chamomile, guys. Yes, I knew that because I've actually got chamomile in there. So I've got two boxes of them, guys. I probably will be gifting one to somebody. And then I got the meditation incense sticks, which smell absolutely amazing. This is vanilla and sandalwood with chamomile. Oh, this was 99p, I think this one guys, or 120. Uh, and they use for meditation, so that would be great for me. And then last but not least, I got these two A4 prints on picture paper, same as like Hannah Horror's picture paper. Slightly different, I think this is more of a glossy, as Hannah's more of a matte. This is definitely a, a glossy one. They're quite thick, I must admit. Very, very thick paper. Absolutely love these guys. So this one is Jack with Oogie Boogie in the moon looking down. I kind of like that as a tattoo, guys. Guys, these were 99p. <gasps> 99p! I know I paid something like £4 delivery, but I wasn't too bothered because we're getting two prints and all these incense sticks. There was a few things I wanted to grab, but, you know, I had lots of businesses that I was trying to buy from at the same time. And then the second print, guys, is this one here. And I absolutely love this one. This is probably one of my favourites. I like the fact that they've just put that little accent of green through it. I love it. 
99p these were 9.99 guys if these are still on I, uh, it'd be a miracle that i can say but if they are still on by the time this video goes up which will be in sometime in october i will put the links down below but if they're not guys i'm sorry you missed out maybe i should just put it on instagram for you guys if you want to just go and grab it i will be taking some pictures so you get to see little boutique as well guys while i'm at it um they do mystery boxes themed each month they're 30 pound each i have never tried the themed boxes i may just jump into one or two and grab some i do like the trick-or-treat box that one was 15 pound and 10 pound for your bolt on which is your t-shirt i may go back into that one as well next year and back to a cult for a little while we'll see there's a lot of boxes i want to try but little boutique do 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 shoes on there guys and clothing accessories they do one that's like really really cheap items like these that you can get your hands on one penny items and stuff like that and i think she does some kind of raffle or a, a, like a what's it called like an auction kind of thing i've never done it guys because i never win anything but this to me is what i was waiting for for ages to come because i absolutely love these they took they took about a week to come guys and i'm completely fine about that because it does say that there is a waiting time and when i know that something's going to be a while it doesn't bother me i just like to sit and wait but these weren't that long guys I only waited like six days or something and they came they were perfectly packaged in like the box that i used to get for trick-or-treat box i knew it was them straight away so that is it guys that is my mixed halloween items from my jack skeleton pictures my jack skeleton um calendar my patch my pumpkin patch my incense sticks my little pussy cat and my little yoda i was supposed to be adding two gloves into this haul guys but unfortunately they ain't turned up again so i'm destined not to have these gloves i tell you i may do them in a separate video if not i'll just put on instagram all right guys i will link everything if it's still there below in the description box so you can go and grab them so this was ebay guys little boutique and jd williams so go check them out Alright guys, take care of yourself. Happy, happy Halloween. Stay safe, keep warm, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. I oh, got too serious though. Bye for now. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and hit that like button if you like this video, because it helps me out and my channel. Take care, guys, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.